This is Poco? Poco. Poco. Poco Bueno. Okay. Poco's not loco, is he? No, I hope not. <laughs> For your sake. <laughs> he tells me now. <laughs> For my sake. Hope he's not crazy. We've got some cattle we've got to clean out of this pasture down here. We're down here south of University Parkway. It's very it's a very critical time of the year because as you move cattle into a different pasture, if the calves don't go with their mamas, they'll be abandoned. Okay. Usually three to four days, and they're weaned off their mamas. There's also the threat of coyotes hunting those stranded calves down. So my instructor Jason McKendry and I hopped on our horses and started moving cattle through what are referred to as pinning lanes, which can be up to 60 feet wide. And with 130 acres of land to cover, calls for many long days and nights for just two men. Well, it's not a nine to five job, as you can see. Uh, my day usually starts around 5.30. It is also interesting to know about the three-month breeding window that over 1,500 cows are going through. 90-day breeding season. That means that we stick the bulls out for 90 days. They have 90 days to breed every cow in this ranch. Uh, as you asked me earlier, we do one bull to every 25, 25 cows. One bull to every 25 cows. One bull to every 25 cows. So that's a happy bull, huh? That's a happy bull. There's a lot of cigarettes smoked in these pastures. <laughs> we also rounded up cows with the touch of a horn. Come on! Come on! That old baby calf there just hit the ground last night. I can honk a horn, I can move 500 head of cows with a honk of a horn. But once they start having them baby calves,